In this tutorial, we're going to teach you how you can use wp-config to automatically repair database problems. First of all, we need to connect to a server. And first of all, you need to connect to your server with STP. First, you need to connect to your server. You can do this with FTP, SFTP, or SSH, whichever you're comfortable with. Then on your server, which we've already connected to this one here, we need to locate the wp-config file, which is generally just in the root directory uh, usually called public HTML and in here we just need to scroll down a little bit uh, until we find where it says to stop editing the file and just below this fs method we need to insert a new line that says define wp allow repair and set that to true then save after you've made this change to wp config and saved it you need to go back to your WordPress website and then we need to go to this address here so it's your domain name slash WP admin slash maint slash repair or PHP. Here we can choose to repair or to repair and optimize the database. It's probably best you click repair and optimize depending on your situation. As we can see, WordPress has gone through and repaired and made any optimizations possible to that database. Now, all we need to do is jump back into WP config and remove the line we just added. And then we can go back to our WordPress website and return just to the home page, and as we can see, it's all loading according to plan. So that's all you need to do to manage your database problems through WP Config. If you have any questions, please ask below.